welcome back. Welcome back to the Trans Tasman Challenge, round two. Gentlemen, you can see in front of you, you have easels, you have paper, you have pens. How's your drawing skills? Shocking. It's not very often you see me not, not this confident. Mm, I like a confidence from Australia. What about New Zealand? How's the drawing, the artistic skills? I'm not going to lie, it's not that good. Yeah, I can't say it's a strong suit, but we'll uh, give it a good match. All right, this is going to be an enjoyable challenge. Three points up for grabs here. It's natural art. Five minutes to draw. Natural. New Zealand, you are drawing the Tuatara. Australia, you're drawing the Echidna. Five minutes on the clock. Your time starts now. Okay. Australia. What's his name? Echidna. Drawing Echidna. Eddie. the Echidna. I've named him Eddie. New Zealand, drawing the Tuatara. A detailed representation is what we're looking for. Three points up for grabs here in round two, natural art. Okay, so we can just... Less than grass to me, Are you doing a little bit Beautiful. of landscape as well for the Tuatara? Yeah, yeah. Well, Do you know what the name Tuatara actually means? I'm guessing you've got the answer. Mm. Fantastic, what is it? Spines on back. Spines on back is Spines. what they... Peaks, peaks on back, peaks on back. Pigs on back. Peaks. Pigs. Peaks. Peaks. <laughs> Okay, My Australian do. accent, that, yeah. that broad, pigs, yeah, right. pigs on back. Pigs on back. Yeah, he's got a pig on his like, back. Okay, yeah. Pigs on yeah. back. The echidna, mm -hmm. one There's of two. One of one two. two. Do you know one of two what? No. Now the concentration no. on your face, Marcus. Well, look, I'm just trying to figure out where where, yeah, where would Eddie be? For the landscape. Where would Eddie be? Don't Eddie would be... Landscapes, yeah, I like mm. it. One of two monotremes. Yeah, I thought so. Monotremes. Yeah, the egg laying ah, mammals. Of course, of course. Yes, yes. The other one is the? Uh, platypus. Very good, very good. You did listen in school. That was a guess. <laughs> <laughs> Look at Eddie. Eddie's, Eddie. Eddie. Eddie's not happy. He's not <laughs> bad. He's happy. His head's more. Over this side. That looks like a fly breathing dream. <laughs> <laughs> Slash a crocodile. Oh, I see. That's actually the Tuatara there. I thought that was more rocks. It's, um, no. That's really good work. No, it's really good work. Two and a half minutes. We're out of the park. We are halfway through, gentlemen. Halfway through. He has a third eye. <laughs> it's it's up on top of his head. I'm sorry. It's about sensing the uh, the light for his circadian rhythm. He's got a wee third eye. Right a wee there. third eye. I don't know if you can see it though. I think it's underneath the scales. Oh, he's got a third eye here. These are actually pink salmon swimming upstream, as opposed to the trout. I love the creativity. The creativity, remember, three points up for grabs here. Should we get a tree in there? I think Eddie's done. I'm not sure Eddie can get better. I think Eddie's done, and in the sky are some clouds. Uh, do you reckon there are some birds? I reckon there's some birds. Draw some birds. Oh, yeah. A couple of birds They're in the birds. sky. They're birds. They're birds. Um, he's also coming along birds. nicely for Australia. Time ticking away, gentlemen. Finishing touches, 30 seconds. All the pens have been put down on the Australian side. I think we're happy what else lives around there. New Zealand, looking like they're close. Absolutely beautiful. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5. Finishing touches. 3, 2, 1. Time's up, gentlemen. Pens down. Congratulations. You've completed the second challenge. Let's have a look at the Tuatara by New Zealand. There you go. Your Tuatara. Yes. On the rocks, the sunshine, some lovely clouds there the Tuatara we were looking for. Pretty good, you, you want to talk us through the artwork? We've gone with the Tuatara, obviously a bit of a nice big bold eye. This third eye which should be affected in for extra points. The bulbous eyes, yes, I, I, I can see that. Also and signed it and Mitch has kindly named him Diego. Okay, so as far as accuracy goes, I think I think half a point, the ridges, the third eye, the bulbous eyes. Thank you. Creativity, I like the I like the scenery, I like that he's on the rocks. Yeah. So a point for that one. And that tree, very, very nice. So another point for the tree. Thank you. Gives you two and a half out of three. Well done. Well done, New Zealand. Two Thank and a half you. points for their Tuatara. Very nice. Crossing over to Australia. Let's have a look at your echidna if you'd like to spin the board. <laughs> this is the echidna. Again, he's been named. This is Eddie. Funnily enough, Eddie can talk as well, so he's He's a very happy echidna, a nice little smile there, enjoys playing in the grass amongst the trees, the birds and the fish. So here's the echidna we were looking for. Yeah, there's the snail. I, I see you've got him facing the right direction, so that's definitely a plus. Is that his brother? Yeah. It could be his brother. This yeah. is uh, George. For, for accuracy, maybe half a point uh, for that. Uh, what, what, what was inaccurate? Well, Sorry, see, what's, the, what's the, the, the hind legs are actually pointing backwards. You've got the hind legs pointing forwards. You've got a, like, quite a big belly on him. You can see that the echidna's got quite a flat 
Oh, okay, uh, so we're being picky. Cause he, cause we're being picky. <laughs> well, it was about accuracy. So half, half a point for your accuracy. Uh, creativity, again, with the scenery. The pink salmon swimming upstream. upstream. Beautiful. Don't There's a the, point there. Don't forget the cool sun. The cool sun. As well. With, the, uh, like with the sun. sun. I get cool it. Sun. Yeah, so a point there. And execution. I guess, I guess half a point there as well. So two points, two points for Australia for their depiction of the echidna. Uh, so there you go, two points for Australia, two and a half points for New Zealand in the natural art round. Very, very close competition. We'll be back round three after the break.